Hello, Gothic friends. Last one is my name. Welcome back to the worst let's play of the world, Gothic 2 Live Edition Hardcore. We are done with the city of Corinis for the time being, with our quest, with our progress. We have to go to the mercenaries and I hear some noises. We have to go to the mercenaries and watch out and find out what happened to the Bennett. Why did he kill the Lothar, the Paladin. There are many such. We are going to try to see if we can do anything with the Seekers. We have to find out why are they here. Luckily, if we don't get too close or too far away to their range, then we can... Okay, we managed to do that. Actually, we will just walk. We have the option to teleport ourselves, but apparently we can walk. We also got access to the monastery to try to equip the the Eye of Enos. Here was a plant, I believe, right? Ah, yeah, whatever. And after that, after we find out what really happened here a bit, because we will get out of the flow otherwise, we will go to the Yarkandar. Probably in this episode or the next episode. Oh, there is another Seeker. If they do not aggro us directly, then we have a chance. There are two Seekers. That's not what I wanted to do. We have caught you in our trap, and now we shall destroy you. Oh, the guy was here. Okay, that, that was good that he did not possess us. That's why we have to be careful not to get possessed by them. But this guy wanted also to talk to us. Egil might have a quest for us. Yeah, we do get some quests now. Not Egil, I believe he's the Enim guy. You're still here? Obviously. Of course. Still miffed? Never mind, forget about it. Say. Have you been to Lobart's farm lately? Maybe. Why? Oh, nothing important. I just wanted to talk to Vino again about his still. So we have an option to buy it from him. Still? Or just still. look oh, where we could I find it. I probably shouldn't have said that. Vino's always been very particular about his little secret. Whatever. Now I've let it slip out anyway. Back in the woods, Vino set up a secret still. A while ago, he asked me to get him something to grease his portcullis with. It's rained a lot recently and the thing rusted shut on him. Now the winch is stuck. And no one can get in anymore. What a mess. Yeah, tell us about it. And? Have you got the grease? Yeah, sure. The best there is. Mole rat fat. Terrible stuff, let me tell you. It's even used to grease ship's cannons. Sell me the grease. That won't be cheap, pal. It's damn rare in this part of the country. How much? Mm, 100 gold coins. That's too expensive. That's too much. Okay, okay. 70 gold coins then. But that's my final offer. That's still too expensive. That's still too much. Then forget about it. Have a nice day. Hey, I don't have any time. Yeah, whatever. We are not going to pay that. We can get the grease anyway. For 30, I believe, or 60. I don't think he would give us any experience. Akil, do you have anything hey. for us? Is there any other news? Someone keeps stealing my sheep lately. I haven't been able to sleep properly for nights. Who could have done that? I've got a hunch about that. Some really nasty fellows have settled into the caves over in the forest. I find it hard to believe that they're living on berries. I'm almost certain that's where my sheep are disappearing to. Yeah, we have a quest for him. We know where the bandits are. We already been into that cave. Hangover? No, I feel fine, really. Looks like Rukar won't be getting. He has a quest for us, but I believe in the fourth chapter, or the fifth chapter. I believe the fourth with a hangover. So for the time being, we will just go to Orland, check his inventory. Oh, the city looks so nice from here. 
after Orlan, we can also go to the Gita. She might have something useful. Oh, look, a seeker. There he is. Nice. More health we need. Ah, probably sleeping wouldn't have been a bad idea. Ah, no, it's too early. We don't really want just to sleep. There are some quests here in Kurinis, but we might do them once we come out of Yarkandar because there might be new stuff. Will it ever change? How's it going with your tavern? Hopefully these black magicians will move Damn black soon. magicians. Otherwise, I can close the tavern. Almost nobody dares to come here anymore. I did come. Show me. Certainly. Yeah, lots of arrows. We are more than welcome to take them out of you. Can't rely on that. And that's it. But no, he insisted he knew better. What about Dragomir? Yeah, I have to give him the, the crossbow before we keep selling it. There you are, Dragomir. Here, I found your crossbow. Indeed, this is mine. Don't tell me you were up by the stone circle. Most certainly. That was pretty reckless of you. Such a nice anyway. voice. Has the actor. Naturally, I'll repay this deed. I hope this is enough. Yeah, if we would want to learn from him, then that's what he asks for. The Gita, yeah, she might have something useful, but the forest is quite scary for the time being. What I would really, really like to is go to Gan and check out if he is teaching us to remove the the horns. Yeah, because we have uh, anyway a quest there with oh a seeker with what's his name, Bengar. Yeah. That happens sometimes, or aim is playing against us. We need bo better bow accuracy. Sometimes we just simply hit them with no problems. Honestly, I expected them to be a bit more harder than what they already are now. But we will accept. So here spawn no enemies, right? We will have to clear some of the caves because in the fourth chapter there are new stuff that spawns in the caves and then we will lose experience. So oh, wow, this is deadly. Maybe we can kill those things, but in order to do that, I want to be able to take their horns because they have a lot of horns. Ah, there is a seeker. There is another one. Yeah, let's clear out those things. There he is. They sometimes they just want to to hit us without talking. Oh, another dragon. Yeah, that, that's scary. Once we can take their horns, then we can try to battle them. But without the horns, because there are a lot of them and we need money, as I said. There he is. Yeah, up close is better because we don't really miss. Ooh, we are out of stuff to eat. Yeah, the apples are good. Every 25 we will get some increase. Oh, I heard some noise. The arrow, yeah, we dropped the arrow. Another seeker there. There he is. Yeah, 
there we are. Ship sausage and sausage, okay. Different stuff. I hope the gun is not dead. It looks clear, a bit scary. Ah, the gun is still alive. There is the guy that he needs for the quest. Here, 100 gold coins for your expertise on gutting animals. Thanks. Now you're talking. What can you teach me? Just watching that something useless. What you want to know. Bloodfly wings, remove claws, extract it. Nothing. Well, I guess only the guy in the Valley of Mine could teach us. Remove the horns. Seeker. One stock. Nice. Good that you wanted to change your bell. So we can talk with Vengar. Uh, he will send us to a quest anyway. Yeah, look, you look lonely here, my friend. The militia are gone, and Balthazar oh. can use your land again. Forgot about that. Why? Because I said so. Hmm. All right. Whatever you say. Let him find a place for his beast somewhere behind the field. Okay. Thank you. How's the situation? Malik has disappeared and taken everything and everybody who would work for me with him. He said he was headed for the mountains. He couldn't stand it here anymore. The hordes of monsters pouring out of the pass every day into the high pastures are really getting to me. If at least I had a few helpers or mercenaries. There was even one who was willing to work for me. Changed his mind, though. I think his name was Wolf. We will get him. It'll be all right. Without Malik, nothing gets done around here anymore. If something doesn't happen soon, I'll have to give up my farm. Hopefully, he'll come back soon. We will not allow it to, for you to lose your farm. So what we can do is actually go to also here to Errol. There is Errol. Did anything spawn here? It was his decision, wasn't it? Okay, nothing. Hey you, buddy. What do you want? These last few days, I've been thinking about how we can make some quick money in this dump. And? I think I've stumbled across a possibility of making money fast. A merchant from town would shell out a lot of dough for a certain thing. Okay. Why are you telling me this? I can't do it myself. I need to stay here and watch those stupid sheep. You mean the farmers? That's what I'm saying. What's this about? The merchant claims that he could market shadow beast horns very profitably. Someone would have to go to the woods and harvest those beasts. And that's where you come in. How much is to be gained there? A bunch of money, I tell you. There will be enough for the two of us. And since you gave me that gold back then, yep. I'll make you Five a Five gold, price. we will get 50 Sounds extra. good. I'll let you know when I manage to get some horns. I'll get some more Shadow Beast horns for your merchant. Two. Great. That's very good. Three, actually, Give okay. Here. And get me more. Who knows for how long that merchant will still want these things. Here's your share. Nice. We got a good money income. I just remember we have to go to skip also. That isn't true. Show me. There isn't much. And yeah, there is no choice at all. We have nothing. Yeah, before I forget, we will go to skip anyway. That's no secret. Oh, we need... Oh, we got a key, a potion, a scroll, okay, that we didn't use before. We teleport in different part now of the city, apparently. We toss the key. I know where this is now. Yeah, we will go to skip. Tell him about Greg because this is also a gimmick that not 
many people know about or that people really forget to use it. We haven't slept, so Halvor cannot sell, cannot buy our silver stuff yet. We will just go to Skippy Skip, and from there we can take the teleport back to the Orland Tavern, and then go to the mercenaries and inform them of what happened. Didn't we kill At Attila? Apparently we didn't, because he has a crossbow. I really thought we did. But oh well. I believe we, we fight him, but we didn't kill him. He doesn't die anymore in this version. Like he's not a default enemy that simply dies. He might be also a seeker. We are still missing the pickaxe. I just remember that also, but not going to spend 300 gold on it. And after we come from Yarkandar, we are going to clear a lot of stuff. Do you know anyone? Yeah, with an 150. I know plenty of men with eye patches. There's someone roaming the land of Corinus who seems to know you rather well. Can't imagine who. I have no dealings with landlubbers. But leave it be. I'm really not interested. Okay. The package we are going to keep on. We are going to give it to you, but once we are in Yarkandar, that will save us 200 gold coins. But now we can take the portal to Orland's Tavern, and from there we can walk. And we will be almost where we were before, so no biggie. There are some monsters that found. We are stuck into something. There is something that... Ah, there he is. And the bow is very good for finding the enemies. This was more than perfect, actually. They have some gold. Potion, most of the potion is the speed potion, but the problem with the speed is it's 40 seconds. By the time it kicks in, it's already over with the speed. That's my feeling. They really, really nerfed them out. They are still a good money source. The arrow. At least we do have a lot of arrows now. So, yes, now we can go back to... The mercenaries to the road that we took on. Yep, this is the road. There might be some enemies also. From here between us, uh, Orland's Tavern and the... Uh, what's the name? Buster and Errol. Ah, there, he, there they are. Two of you. We need more health. Two at once we cannot take, for sure. But one could be doable. Yeah, it's because we have a lot of power in the... Probably we need the other armor against the Seekers. We need more fire resistance. Very nice. So the way is a bit safer now. As it seems. Did we collect plants? Yeah, we did. We will go to Sekob later on. Because there is also a quest with them. What we can actually do is yeah, go to the mercenaries. Find out what they want from us. There should be another seeker somewhere. Oh, I see one. There he is. There he is. The fire effect is so nice. Why do they get stuck into thin air? 
I think there is no need to waste it anymore. The other ones are, yeah, into the forest there. We will kill all of them, don't get me wrong, it's just not the time to do that yet. So we have to find out what happened. Wolf could be hey. sent to the guy. I may have found a job for you on Bengar's farm. Let's hear it. The pass to the Valley of Mines comes out directly at Bengar's farm. He's got problems with all the beasts who squeeze through the pass. Someone needs to defend Bengar's farm. That would be something. Then at least I'd be away from the farm here and wouldn't have to stare at the smithy. Agreed. And since you're one of us, I'll make you a fair price. Just give me 300 gold coins and I'm on my way. Here's your gold. Good. 100 experience for 100 gold. Let's see who else on this farm I can enlist. See you later. So, Elena. Show me. What can I offer you? We had the ham, but the ham is expensive. Oh, Hodge, you are one. Can I buy weapons from you? I don't have much. That's been known a long time. I hardly know what to believe. Okay. Why aren't you working? Haven't you heard yet? The paladins have arrested Bennett. That's the first I've heard of What happened? Well, we were in the city to shop when all of a sudden we heard a scream. Someone yelled, There they are. Get them. Boy, was I scared. I took to my heels and ran like the demons were after me. Bennett was right behind me. I don't know what happened, but when I got outside the city, he had disappeared. I must have lost him in the city. So I just ditched him, right? So why was Bennett arrested? Murder. Bennett is supposed to have murdered a paladin. What nonsense. I was with him the whole time. So why don't you go to town and explain the whole thing? They'd stick me in the slammer as his accomplice. Nah, certainly not in the current situation. Situation? You know, Onar in the city. That's bound to come to a bad end. I agree with you completely. How did the mercenaries here on the farm react? Well, I don't know exactly what they're planning, but some of them are really pissed off. I can understand that. But they will not do nothing. To them, they'd rather attack the city today than tomorrow to get Bennett out. Talk to Lee. Maybe there's something you can do. Cypher, you might have something for us, right? Show me sure. Some arrows. You're more than welcome. And that's it. Where have you been? I was in the Valley of Mines. There are right. dragons there. They gave the paladins a pretty hard time. So? Then there really is something to the stories. Lee will be interested. You just have to listen. Have you got something for me to do? Have you seen those black hooded guys creeping by here? Those people give me the willies, I'll tell you. When I was at sea, I saw some pretty curious things, but those fellows really scare me. They went to the direction of the bandit camp in the mountains at the southern end of the valley. Maybe you should go there and check on those guys and do away with them. That's all just Okay, we might do that. So, oh, Gordon, welcome back. Everything all right with you? You saved my ass, man. I'll never forget that. What do you want to do now? I think I'll load up on grub first. And then? Who knows? Maybe I'll go back to the mining colony. Someone should keep an eye on the orcs. Otherwise, they'll all show up on the doorstep without warning. Where did you pick that up, then? I'll let, but I believe he gets nothing new, right? What weapon? Only the. Okay, the arrows, they are more than welcome. Yeah, dragon bow. This is very good. What bow do we have? Yeah, this is way too far away, and ours is 150. And his is 165. Yeah, it's a bit better. But expensive. Ah, it's good that you've come. I have freed Gorn. 
Yes, you already told me. Good work. He's worth more than Silvio and his boys put together. But well, Silvio's boys are free, you know. Do you have better armor for me? I sure do. All that matters is strength. That's all so Protection weapon 75, 200. Give me the heavy armor. Here, very good armor. It's the same that I wear. No, it's not, you little trickster. Why is this better? Well, because magic protection, protection against fire 20 and this 15 only. Yeah, but we are a mercenary. About time to change the armor. I know that we can get one from Bennett and so on, but I do want to have different armors. From the Valley of Mines. The castle there was attacked by dragons. So it's true. Lares said that rumors about dragons are circulating through the city. I didn't believe it. Gorn could have told you. He was there. They've been thoroughly decimated. Good. Maybe now Lord Hagen will think again about my offer. And if not, then we'll find another way to get out of here. I've come. So it's what about? Ah, we already told you that. And if Don't you have anything else for me to do? You can't get enough, hmm. <laughs> You're in plenty of trouble as it is. What else do you want then? Another assignment. I'm a mercenary, remember? All Very right, true. I've got something. It's just the thing for you. I have a debt to settle with the judge in town. I'd actually prefer to do it myself. But the paladins wouldn't let me within a stone's throw of his house. The thing has to be handled with a bit of consideration, so pay attention. You'll go to the judge and offer him your services. You'll try to win his trust and carry out some dirty work for him until you find something to incriminate him. The swine has done so many dirty jobs that it stinks to high heaven. Bring me something I can use to blacken his name with the militia so that he spends the rest of his life molding in the slammer. But I don't want you to kill him. That would be too quick. I want him to suffer, understand? It's gruesome. You think you can do that? You listen to the wrong people. No problem. How much? Your reward depends on what you bring me, so make an effort. Will it ever change? That's what about Bennett? So you heard about that. The bastards have locked him up, just like that. As if I didn't have enough problems with my own people. Now I have to take care of the paladins too. What will you do about Bennett? I don't know yet. A few of the boys would like to run to the city and knock Lord Hagen's teeth down his throat. Good decision. Don't have enough people for an operation like that. And besides, it's not my style. Are you going to stay here and see what happens then? Certainly not. Lairs is still in the city and trying to find out how we can get Bennett out of there. Until that happens, I'm trying to calm my people. I only hope that Lairs doesn't take too long. Oh yes, before I forget, Buster wants to talk to you. He wouldn't tell me what it was about. Maybe you should go see him. Quite weird that he wouldn't tell the boss what he wants to talk about. Can I help you in this matter with Bennett? Sure. A bit of intelligence and sanity certainly wouldn't hurt in this matter. Enos oh, thank knows you, Lee. there are enough idiots running around here. Go to the city and see if you can find a way to get Bennett out of there. But don't be too long about it. I don't know how much longer I can keep the men under control. Okay, so we stock up on more quests now with the mercenaries. We have better armor. On the defense side, a lot better. On the magic side, a bit worse. Yeah, a bit worse on the magic side. And we cannot improve it for sure. We could sleep. Yeah, because it's quite late anyway. It's getting late. And no, practically we could go to the guy, see what he can teach us. But there are some powerful monsters on the way, right? Oh, right, he wants us to kill the Seekers. Yeah, but see, down there, there is something that... That it's off limits to us. If the guy can teach us, then we can kill those guys. If not, then pff, 
no clue. Probably just forget about learning that skill. Remove the horns of the dragon beast. Where is the guy? Oh, he's sleeping, right? Grom. Did we give you the food? Here's the food you wanted. Fantastic. And now? Oh, we can learn to cheat. Teach me how to hunt. What do you want to learn? You don't want that, right? Damn it. Is it really only the guy in the Valley of Mines? Do I really have to just simply go back to the Valley of Mines and learn that skill? I mean off screen because it makes no sense to just go there. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'll just go off screen there and then... Where is the gang? Farmer? Okay, here. Yeah, those people are scared of the Seekers. Aren't there more Seekers? Yeah, there are. We have to kill those before we talk with those guys, so probably we will do that real fast. And then talk to them and send them home. There he is. And we level up also. Perfect timing, if you ask me. Uh, we are going. I'm going to go off screen to the belly of mines and learn that skill. We have a wolf teleport, uh, summon spell, or oh, lurker. Yeah, lurker is okay. And just simply go there and deal with that. Yep, that's the plan. All right, the gorns. Oh, we are almost out of money because we learned that. Oh, we bought that. What are you doing here? I fled here from Bengar's farm. I didn't want to be butchered by all those creatures coming out of the pass. You can't imagine what sort of things came out of the pass the last few days. I can. What's it like here? Here I only have to put up with the bandits. It's the lesser evil. Bengar needs you. He wants you to come back to his farm. I'm not crazy. As long as we have to live defenseless on the farm, I'm not budging an inch from here. I've hired a mercenary. He will keep an eye on the farm. That's different, of course. But wait a minute. Who's paying the guy then? That's my problem. Hmm. No chance to say no, eh? Nope. No. Good. Then I'll go back. I hope the lad's good for something. I just hope there are no more seekers to kill them. But we have seen that there is a seeker, so I'm just going to walk to the path to the pass, but first we have to kill those. So as long as we have enemies to kill on the way, we will just keep the video running, yeah. But I believe after this it's How do we miss up close? Yep, how do we miss like that really? We didn't save. Oh boy. He's mad. Sorry, we have to redo this. We know all the things that the guy says. We just spoke to him. Now uh, we have to heal ourselves again. We took more hits. We will fight with that seeker and then we will see each other back here at the Sentenza after. Oi. Oh right, we take more damage because of the armor saw. So. Can we be smarter? This one has fire 30. Even better. So we have an armor for the seekers and an armor for uh, other enemies. Oh, he has a powerful spell now. Yeah, powerful but not powerful enough for us. 
This is really annoying, right? The, the thing with the sword, not the sword, the arrow. And I'm not sure if here is an enemy. But yeah, we, I, I really, really want to. Oh, there is a seeker, okay. There he is. And we have the wrong armor. And he has the powerful spell. Nice. We deal it. So sadly, there is also no more teleport to the, to the pass. They remove it. Yeah, here is nothing. I guess we are going to make a cut here, guys, and I'll have to go to the Valley of Mines all alone because I'm not going to kill anything at all. We will just simply run as in the in the lurker form. Yeah, that's what we are going to do. Ah, wolf, there you are. Hey, you. Everything going well? Sure. Everything's quiet. Right, we have the wrong armor. Just notice. So, Malak is back. Hey. We can tell the Bengar and then. Will you stay on Bengar's farm? Then now? we will make a cut and sure. we will see each other at the same things are back. Now. We'll manage somehow. Yeah, we will have to clear the quest for Torlof. And then at the end of the next episode, probably we will be into the Yarkandar finally. Oh, Gun is here. Really? Didn't know that. I found you the mercenary you wanted. I've never seen anyone like that on my farm. I can only hope it'll work out. Here, take this. I think you'll find it useful. Malak is back. It's about time. I thought I'd never see him again. Okay, we are going to make a cut here. Thank you very much guys for joining me. I'll see you in the next episode. Be cool and bye bye.